I would not have agreed to this. <laughs> if I'd known you were going to ask me these questions. <laughs> I gotta go in here and get some leave because I've got a oh. racking headache. Okay, so I'm Bowen Wheeler and I'm an electrician for any hour services. So that meeting that we were in? Uh, Just barely. This morning? Yeah. yeah. So that is something that uh, us electricians do every other Thursday um, and that was what we call our technical training and we go over stuff that guys are seeing in the field, things that guys are struggling with in the field, um, technical specs, technical things that we can work together on as a team and help each one of our guys overcome their weaknesses and help those weaknesses become strengths, which in turn just performs better in the field and our customers get a better experience and a better job. Yeah, we're stuck in traffic like mad here. This is brutal. This is actually unfortunate for dispatch at this point. If you were sitting in dispatch right now, they'd probably be pulling their hair out. So we are here, finally. We have made it across our journey. What, uh, what usually happens when you get someone? This customer is the only customer that matters right here and now. I don't care what's on my schedule. I do, as far as I'm concerned right here and now, there's nobody past this. And then what we'll do uh, generally is we get out, we get our, our mat and we go to the front door with our rug and our uh, shoe covers and floor savers and stuff like that. We knock on the door, they're expecting us and then we go from there. So today we're putting one on right now and it's a ground bridge for phone TV cable. So we're gonna bolt this thing or for that matter, we're gonna hammer drill it to the wall and then we'll run a little jumper out of it up and into the meter and I'll open this up and show you how this is all done inside. I'm under no illusions that I'm the last person that will ever be inside of this. So I try to put it together and put it in place that the next electrician, if it's not me that comes in behind me, isn't standing here cussing me out because I did something wrong. Take a step back. Yeah, that's pretty. That right there is premium work. Yeah. Alrighty, All right, buddy. Good luck. Call me if you have any problems. Okay. We'll Everything's under warranty. Right, See you, buddy. See you later. So when we get our new calls in, this is what happens. So we know that this is a level one priority. Uh, we are going to. Which sounds super familiar. Which. Okay, so I was here last Friday. So what's your what's like the best part of your day? The best day? part of my day, yeah. my kids. I would not have agreed to this <laughs> if I'd known you were gonna ask me these questions. My kids are always there waiting for me. The minute I pull in, they're on my back porch and super excited to see that I'm home. Best part of my day. What we're actually wanting to do is install a new dedicated circuit to help eliminate the overload so that it stops tripping. But there's a knockout right here and essentially all we would be doing is doing a box offset with some conduit into this box with a breaker and would feed it right down here about right there and drill a hole right through the back of the house and then feed wire in and be done. So any hour stocks the truck for you? 100% absolutely. Yeah, talk to me about that. Essentially I'm driving around in a mobile parts house and I have everything I need to complete my daily tasks that you know whatever we come in contact with. You know, any hour 
again, treats our people super well. Yeah. What does that mean for the customer? They get somebody with a positive attitude and um, a smile on their face. They've had two or three people out there. They can't find a solution. And any hour with our training and our ability, we come in and we fix that issue literally in an hour and just to watch the relief on their face. What do you think you do better than anybody else when it comes to helping customers? I don't care about money. No. Nope. I care more about my craftsmanship and who I am. So it's it's great that I make good money and we make great money doing that. But for me, at the end of the day, I will take the loss and I will take the hit because I have said I would do something a specific way. So, and I got that from my old man. So I've always been a firm believer. If I could achieve half of what he's done in his lifetime, I'll be doing all right. Um, I would rather take the loss and do it right than do it wrong and profit from it. Um, it means more to me than that. Um, when I come into a house, I don't, I'm there as any hour, don't get me wrong. Uh, everything's stamped and labeled any hour. Um, but I, I'm Bo and Wheeler. And when I leave that house, I'm Bo and Wheeler. So essentially, they need to know not only who the company is, but who Bo and Wheeler is at the same time. If the light's on, we've won the battle. Game on. Let there be light. Freezer's on and functional. That will take a ton of overload off of the existing circuit. And part of us being as large as we are, that is due to our return customer base, is because our customers love what we can provide and love what we do for them and the way we do it. We treat their home just like we treat our home. We were able to complete two tasks, which is good. And it's only two o'clock. So what do we got next? The whole day. <laughs>